Hey guys, how y'all doing? I'm here to give you guys a recap on a new episode of Dragon Ball Super, which is on episode 35. Now, this episode, nothing much really happening. Maybe a couple of secrets and revelations are to be shown. Who knows? But, um, I just want to get this over with, so if anything else, let's go. If the video is short, there's nothing much I can really talk about, honestly. That's all I can say. Okay, at the beginning of the episode, we have to it that... Uh, Frost and the Vegeta are gonna face each other, fight, but apparently after Frost mentions about he's gonna use his poison, and if there's an accident of a death, that's not his fault, and therefore Vegeta doesn't really care, and therefore it goes Super Saiyan at the beginning of the match and punches a living crack lack at, punches him, one punches him out of the ring, and apparently Vegeta won. And apparently, like, um, there's been, like, a cute thing, a new ring or area thing to start around the arena battle, and... Apparently, um, Goku, apparently Beerus was not, was not, um, fond of this, so he talked to Shampa about it, and they tried selling this out with, like, um, rock, paper, scissors, junk, and palm, whatever you want to call it. But, as they were trying to set out the differences, Frost w was trying to escape, but hit the guy who looks all purple, etc., stops him from doing so, and uses a technique that did not involve anything at all, and therefore defeats Frost. And... The match, therefore, um, was about to begin, but Goku wanted to ask, um, Monoka, like, if he could fight after Monoka. Goku, on the other hand, can come back to, like, um, the fight, you know? And Goku wants to, f wants to, um, fight after Monoka, possibly. But Bira says, no, you must fight, you must fight after Vegeta. And apparently, Whis and Beerus were hi was hiding something. Even Whis was, like, saying, so, what's with you, like, um... Hiding this and that, Goku was asking. But Beerus, on the other hand, says doesn't say anything much. But he seems like he's lying about Monica's abilities, possibly. Who knows? But guess we'll have to find out maybe later. But apparently, as the episode continues with its um, procedure, we have to it that um, Vegeta goes up against this giant robot whatsoever. And it seems like Vegeta has no problem with them. It, problem with them. And apparently lava that my, that the robot has is not a weapon, yada yada yada. And it seems like everything seems to be okay, but towards the end of the episode, after Vegeta turns Super Saiyan, after being cornered up, he is sweating and like um starting to lose his breath pretty quickly. So it looks like that robot was generating a lot of heat in a certain area, and it's in that cube-like format, whatever. And due to that, um, Vegeta's like already in trouble. Okay, next episode, I don't know what's going to happen, but um, it seems like it got, it got a result in Vegeta's loop failure or Vegeta's victory. Who knows? So until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. So I'm Alpha Zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Bye-bye.